the Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops and the Ufungamano Joint Forum of Religious Organizations are calling for consensus building on contentious issues in the Building Bridges Initiative report to incorporate inclusivity. The church leaders want the political class to drive the BBI course with sobriety and refrain from divisive sentiments. The Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops say divided political leadership has polarized the Building Bridges Initiative discourse. While in Nakuru, the church urged political leaders to unite and enlighten the electorate to inclusive amendments of contagious clauses. The leaders want the report to be subjected to a thorough review by various stakeholders to end social and economic problems bedeviling the country. Sahizi, kila kitu ni imported. Tunajaribu tuanze uchumi wetu ambao tunaweza kutoa tunazalisha mali sisi na buy Kenya, build Kenya. So tunahitaji tafakari ya pamoja. The church leaders are opposing the proposed executive constitution that confers an elected president the power to appoint a prime minister and two deputies terming the move imperial presidency. BBI ingekuta soft spot kuendeleza. Na tunaamini inawezekana. Tukiona hela nyingi zitatumika kwa upande gani unaona kwamba zinalenga sehemu ya eh, wanasiasa zaidi. Watu wamebeba tufanyeje tuwapunguzie mzigo wa uzito wa uchumi tukiongezea wabunge zaidi hailetu huduma zaidi this as the ufungamano joint forum of religious organizations opposed the increase of legislative seats in parliament and the senate as proposed in the report while in Nairobi, the clergy said the electorate is already overrepresented in the two houses. The number of constituencies and elected members of the National Assembly be reduced to 150 down from the current 290. In many ca ca uh, countries, the MBs not only represent a much larger constituency, but give a very high level of service. Irene Mchuma Udim, Channel 1.